Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, Hi Phone Pro. Um, I've got something really cool to share with you today. I've got my TX2Z Touch Smart. It's a Hewlett Packard laptop. It's all touch um, and it's awesome. Uh, I know Apple's coming out with their new tablet touch screen and uh, apparently that's going to be really cool. It's going to have the iPhone OS uh, according to rumors and you're going to be able to use all the iPhone apps and games. So really, Microsoft needs to get on the ball and hurry up because if they don't, then um, you know Apple's going to be way ahead of the game there. You know, just to give you a, a real short example here on the media player, this is a uh, Windows 7 operating system, and I'm going to show you their media center that they have now, which is all touch. Totally awesome on this computer. Apparently I'm having some trouble there. I don't know why it's really sensitive usually. Um, but this is really cool. I don't want to get too much into this because I have a lot to show you and you know not a lot of time on YouTube. But of course I got TVs and TV and movies and music and everything else. I'm just going to get out of there, and you can play your movies and look at your pictures and stuff like that. I want to show you the internet, because this is one of the coolest things about this computer. I love the internet, because it's just like using the Safari internet on the iPhone. I mean, you've got, you know, you can use the keyboard, there's the keyboard, type in whatever. And then scrolling is awesome. It's just like the internet. You can't beat it. I mean, just like the iPhone. <laughs> I'm really messing this up. So it's totally awesome. And then another cool thing about this tablet computer is you can spin it around, turn it into a tablet this way, which is great. You know, just like the uh, iPhone, only bigger. <laughs> and the reason I'm doing this video is I was thinking about making a forum because, I mean, you're so limited to the apps and games that you have for this computer that, you know, I want to get people together and start, you know, let's rally and get together on a forum. I'll build a forum if enough people reply to this video and let me know that they want to too, and we'll get it started. Now let me show you some of the apps I have for this. They're limited, but they're great. I mean, it's a lot of these even remind me of like iPhone apps. You got Air Hockey that you can play two players with here. All touch screen. I mean, it's it's really cool. You can't beat it. That's just one game there that I found. And really they're limited. I looked everywhere and you're limited as to the games and drivers for touch screen on Microsoft right now. Which is a real shame because when iPhone tablet comes out with all those apps and games, they're going to just simply blow Microsoft away. And Microsoft is just going to be sitting there. So hopefully there's enough people with these computers, maybe we can get together and um, you know subscribe to my channel and let me know in a comment that you want a forum and that we want to get together and find apps and games for this. And we'll do it. I'll put what I have here you know, out there. Now I want to show you the Lagoon. It, this is from Microsoft Surface. You've probably seen this on some uh, YouTube videos. This is awesome. It's actually it's a screensaver. If I can get it to work. It's a screensaver and it's just like water. It makes a lot of cool like um, cool sounds like for meditation style stuff. And you can touch the water. I've only got one hand because I'm holding camera, but you know, you can do like two hands and stuff like that and hold, you know, you hold your finger there and like all the fish will come to you, as you can see. Not a real big deal, but it's all, I like it. It's a cool app. It reminds me a lot of one of the iPhone apps I've seen. And uh, another cool app is... Google Earth for this. Awesome. I mean, you can't beat that. That is so awesome.
very touch fluent it works great zoom in right in on somebody's house here I think that's a house I don't know <laughs> I got another app it's like one of those 3d um, desktops and it works great like I can squeeze just like the iPhone and use my finger to choose different desktops on this I can spin the, it's like a cube and it's got all kinds of stuff you can use I mean that's awesome and there's another app called cool iris that you can get with Firefox which is pretty awesome works good with this computer as well let me see if I can get out of here now I didn't mean to get into this part there we go anyway I've got other cool some other cool apps too uh -oh. close out with that and these are a part of the touch pack that Lagoon was and then there's this cool game that I mean this game is awesome it nothing more than makes you want to go get a touch computer just to play this game it's so cool a lot like air hockey but it uses like digital it's like digital controllers oh I scored haha <laughs> yeah buddy this is a, this game is just too cool Like I said, I mean, let's get together and start getting these apps and games together and getting people on the ball for designing these things, man, because if we don't, you know, obviously not a whole lot's happening. They're focused on Microsoft Surface when they ought to be more focused on their touchscreen computers, and they should be very worried about the iPhone. Yeah, Microsoft Surface is a big commodity for like the bigger businesses they're going to get a lot of income from that that's great but what about me the guy with the touchscreen computer you know they just don't seem to care they want to let you know mac take all that over and that's fine but um this is like we race boats through this it's pretty cool but you know this could really change things if we can get you know get something better going on with this but anyway that's the video I have for you today I can't think of a whole lot more to show you because they haven't designed a whole heck of a lot for it yet on this specific computer they do have a media smart system let's see if I can pull that up no not today <laughs> anyway Anyway, subscribe to my video and let me know if you want me to build a forum on touchscreen computers, Microsoft, and if we want to put some drivers and games and apps together, let's get together. I want to know what else is out there. I mean, I'm sure a lot of people who have touchscreen don't know about, doesn't know about this cube being all touch. I mean, this wasn't specifically invented for a touchscreen. This was, this has been out for a long time. And you know, then again, you got your, you know, your dock. I can use that all touch. I mean, check that out, you know. So let me know and subscribe to my channel. And always cool to talk to you. And make sure and leave me some comments. See you later, YouTube.